Hi guys, it's Taylor. Welcome back or to my channel if you're new. Today's video is a styling video of five different ways to wear pleated skirts. Pleated skirts or tennis skirts, whatever you want to call them, are huge this fall. I've been seeing them all over Pinterest and Instagram and I'm really excited to show you guys these outfits because they're all so cute and really wearable. The outfits are catered more towards the colder fall weather as I live in Canada, but you guys can easily swap out the tops, add layers, take off layers, to fit the weather wherever you guys are living. So as always, don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. Like and comment on this video to support me and help my videos get out there. Follow my Instagram and let's get into the outfits. So the first way I styled the pleated skirt is in a sporty slash preppy way. So this is one of the most popular ways that I've seen people style the pleated or tennis skirts especially on Pinterest. So for this outfit, I just paired it with this white little pleated tennis skirt that I got from American Apparel, but I know these are really hard to find. I searched so long to find the perfect one, and I actually found this on Amazon, so I'll have the exact one that I purchased linked in the description box. As always, everything will be in the, in the description box, but I'm pretty sure the American Apparel skirts just came back in stock, and I got mine in an extra small, and it fits me perfectly. My measurements will be in the description box as well. It's just the perfect pleated tennis skirt. The only thing is it doesn't come with an underlining under it, so just make sure you wear like boy shorts under it or boxers or don't, whatever you want to do. And then with that, I just paired it with this huge oversized navy blue hoodie that I actually got from the thrift store. I'll try to find something similar down below, but the hoodie makes this outfit really preppy because I don't know what exactly the logos are on this, but it looks to be some sort of sorority or university imprinted all over it, but I love it. It just makes it so preppy and just gives off really cute school vibes. Really oversized, it's in a men's large or extra large, something like that. And I also just added this little black headband that I got from Shoppers Drug Mart or something. I just love the way that it pulled the outfit together. It just adds that sporty and preppy touch to the outfit. For the shoes, I just threw on my Nike mids. I find myself reaching to these a lot recently and I just think they go perfectly with the whole sporty vibe and are going to be really nice going into the fall and colder months because they are a little bit more high top so they do keep your ankles warm. I also just brought tucked the hoodie so you can see the skirt a little bit more. I love doing this especially with oversized pieces just to give me a little bit more shape. This outfit is also really easy to swap out if you live in a warmer climate. So I was wearing a black sports bra under the hoodie and you can just really easily take off the hoodie and tie it around your neck. This tennis or golf Thing, sweater tying at trend has also been really huge all over Pinterest and I think it's so cute so if you do live in a warmer climate this is probably a lot more wearable outfit for you and it also just adds that extra sporty touch to it so the next way I styled the pleated skirt was in a preppy way so what makes this outfit really casual and preppy is this charcoal gray Harvard crew neck that I got from H&M I wanted this to be really oversized and comfortable so I got it in a size large and it fits perfectly it just complemented the look that I was going for perfectly I also just threw on a collared dress shirt under to make it a lot more preppy the whole preppy schoolgirl style has been everywhere everyone's obsessing over it and i absolutely love it i think it's so cute i've always loved school fashion i actually like when i was little i always wanted to have a school uniform so this is really just fulfilling my youth dreams this outfit you can really easily swap out the skirt for a plaid one as well i personally like it better with the white pleated skirt but if you wanted to make the outfit even more preppy than it already is you can just swap out the skirt with a plaid one this one i got from h m in a size two and it's literally the exact same style as the American Apparel one. It matches the crew neck very nicely. The plaid skirt just makes it more dressed up and preppy, but if you want to make it more dressed down and casual, you can just pair it with the white one. I personally like the white better, but it's up to you. There's two different ways and two different looks that you can get out of this. To finish off the outfit, I just paired it with my platform sneakers. These sneakers have been my ride or die. They're definitely my most worn sneaker as of right now. I'm so obsessed with them. Just really dresses down the outfit to make it more casual and it also just gives off 
a more preppy schoolgirl vibe, I feel, with the sneakers. So the next way I styled the pleated skirt was in a really cute and girly way. Um, so this one involves a turtleneck and cardigan. I don't know what it is about this pair, but it kind of makes it a little bit more preppy, but I also think it's very girly and cute. So the turtleneck that I paired under this is actually a tank top turtleneck. So if you do live in a warmer climate, this is a really good option for you because it is a little bit more cooling than compared to having a regular turtleneck on. But if you do live in a colder climate, really recommend just wearing a normal turtleneck just for that extra warmth. But this turtleneck is just from Zara. I got it in a size small. It's so cute perfect for layering and then the cardigan is just from H&M I got it in a size large because I wanted it to be really oversized and comfortable and it's in this really pretty cream color and it has three buttons so if you do live in a warmer climate you can just really easily undo the buttons and leave the cardigan open and just for more airflow but for this look since I do live in a colder climate how I would wear it is with the buttons done up and I actually tucked the cardigan into my skirt again just to add more shape and also make it a little bit more warm I found when I had it untucked I kind of just looked very boxy so definitely needed to tuck the cardigan in just to give me a little bit more definition for the shoes I just paired it with my Reebok classics I love these shoes I love the gum feature on the bottom and the shoes are a little bit more of a tennis shoe style so they're a lot more narrow and aren't as like wide and chunky as your air force one so i do feel like they add just a more girly touch to the outfit also feel like this outfit would be really cute if you had some like cute white frilly crew neck socks all right so the next way that i styled the pleated skirt is with a sweater vest so sweater vests are huge this season as well i've been seeing them all over social media and I didn't really think I would hop on the trend because I wasn't sure how I liked it, but I've been seeing so many videos and pictures everywhere where I just decided to do it and I'm so obsessed. So they're a little bit more masculine, especially with the collared button up underneath, but I personally like the juxtaposition of the really boyish and girly vibe between the top and the skirt. So this black v-neck sweater vest I got from H&M. It already is in an oversized fit, so I got it in a size medium because I didn't want it to be too overpowering. And then for the white button up, it's from H&M as well, and I got it in a size large because I really wanted to go for the look where the button up falls underneath the sweater vest or crew neck, whatever you are wearing it under. For this look as well, you can really easily swap out the skirts depending on what look you want to go for. You can wear the plaid to make it more preppy and you can wear the white to make it more casual. I personally like the outfit with the white better. To finish off the look, I just paired this outfit with my platform Doc Martens. I really like the way that the chunky boot looks with the thick chunky sweater vest. I just think they complement each other really nicely. And the last outfit I'm going to show you guys is a casual girly look. So I love an all white or like cream and white monochromatic outfit. It's so flattering and you look bomb because I feel like not a lot of people wear all white outfits because they're scared, but I'm always wearing all white outfits. I think it's so cute and you just stand out because not a lot of people wear it. So for the top, I just paired it with this cropped zip up sweater in this really cute ribbon material. It's so soft and comfortable. I got it from Garage and it's in a size extra small and I just love the hoodie detail on it. I feel like it just makes it very casual and dressed down, which is what we're going for with this outfit. I just absolutely love the way that the cream and the white paired together and also like the different textures of the ribbing with the pleated skirt. It just looks so cute. And then for the shoes, I just wore it with my Nike Air Force Ones. It would not be one of my videos if I didn't throw on my Nikes. So those are all the outfits I have to show you guys in this video. As always, don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. Give this video a like and a comment to support me and help my videos get out there. You can literally comment anything. You can give me a video suggestion or just chat with me in the comments. I just love talking to you guys. I have a lot of really good videos that are coming up that I'm so excited to share with you guys. So make sure you're subscribed and have my post notifications turned on. All the details of every outfit will be linked down below and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.